I'm so happy to be part of tonight's celebration with you. As we celebrate these distinguished members who have helped transform the meetings industry for all of us in this room, I'm reminded of what an important role PCMA has played in transforming my own career. Four years ago, I was close to completing my master's degree in tourism administration at George Washington University here in Washington, DC. Go Colonials! There was just one problem. I honestly didn't know how I was going to pay for my final year of school. I was actively involved with PCMA as a student, and fortunately, I was very lucky to have two outstanding mentors who helped point me toward the scholarship opportunities that the Education Foundation offers. Both Tyra Hilliard and Melissa Riley were instrumental in inspiring me to pursue a career with the CVB and they helped me focus my topic for the application. I remember getting the phone call from Aaron Seamus of the PCMA Education Foundation to inform me that I had won the Student Planner of the Year, and let's just say I was pretty excited. In fact, I dropped the phone. <laughs> After my initial excitement about securing the financial assistance that I needed, I realized the scholarship came with a big duty. I had to plan a full session at Convening Leaders 2010. Tyra and Melissa continued to help me as I outlined a session on sponsorship, and they helped me lock in three excellent panelists. One of them are here tonight, John Hickson of Tourism Toronto. <laughs> they were equally instrumental in helping me network while I was in Dallas, and they also highlighted how important it was for me to earn my CMP which was key in getting hired for my first job at Team San Jose. <laughs> Needless to say, I credit PCMA and the PCMA Education Foundation with giving me a leg up as I entered the industry and helping me to distinguish myself from other emerging meeting professionals. The connections, the education, and the opportunities have all been invaluable. I can spend quite a bit of time looking back at how important PCMA was in the early stages of my career, but the organization continues to play a huge role in my everyday involvement with the industry. Ever since my first convening leaders in Dallas, I've been tied to the PCMA's mission, serving on a range of committees for the Capitol chapter, along with my role in the Foundation's Giving Task Force this year. Now tonight, as I stand in front of this microphone, I'm happy to say that I continue to give back to PCMA each year with my own personal donations to the Education Foundation. It's my way of saying thank you to all the incredible people who have helped me along the way, including Tyra, Melissa, everyone at Courtesy Associates and Smith Buckland, Mark McMinn, Victor Robinson, Johnny White, and so many other meeting professionals who have been part of my career. But I donate as more than a thank you. I'm also paying it forward. I know that there are other students just like me, motivated, driven, ready to make an impact in the meetings industry. I've begun filling the role of role model today. In fact, I've helped three people get jobs this year. <laughs> But there are many students who might need some help just like me. They might be approaching their final years of their programs and stressing about the rising cost of education. On behalf of all of them, I want to thank you for your generous support. You are all making a difference for the future of our industry.